Okay, so this first shot that we're gonna track is a simple one. And it's just a simple painting replacement. And we're gonna do that here in Mocha Pro. You could also do this in Mocha, which comes free with After Effects CS4 and above. But here we have our shot. We're just gonna import it right here into Mocha. And one thing we do wanna note about this is that we have this picture frame, but the picture frame does have a little bit of depth. And so you can see here on the side that the this portion of the frame does extrude a little bit. And because it's a 3D object and not completely planar, we want to avoid tracking that part because it's gonna screw up our track. So all we do here is we're just going to click on this Create Bezier tool, click here, and we're only gonna track the actual photo because it has a decent amount of texture. And we just track it like that, end it off, and we're gonna drag these up because we don't wanna track all of the outside part. Okay, and then we're gonna make sure that we have perspective turned on because the perspective definitely changes as we move around this photo. And we're gonna track back a couple of frames. And one thing we can do to make sure that our track is accurate while it's actually tracking is to click on this show planar surface and show planar grid. And we can just move this to the outside of this guy here. And as long as this track sticks on, then we're gonna be in pretty good shape. Okay, so our track is done, and I'm just going to adjust this a little bit here. And let's scroll through this and see how well our track sticks here in Mocha. And as we scrub through this, it's looking like it did a great job. So after we have this tracked, we're gonna to go to our first frame here and we're going to click on this button right here, which is push the surfaces to the corner of the images. So we just click that and I'm gonna go ahead and click export tracking data. Make sure that we have the After Effects corner pin supports, supports motion blur layer selected and then go ahead and click copy to clipboard. Let's move here into After Effects and we have our shot here and we're just gonna drag that into a new composition. So we have the shot here of the creepy photo and we're gonna take an image that we want to add on. And so this is a shot I took a while ago of my buddy Reed just hanging out out in the grass. So we're gonna take the shot here and we want to crop it so that it has the same aspect ratio of this photo in the original shot. So I can take it and I'm just going to draw a mask around it so that it looks like it's about the same aspect ratio. Something like that would be good. It doesn't have to be perfect. Maybe scale it a little bit wider, something like that. And now I can pre-compose this. Move all attributes into a new composition. So I have this here, and now I can scale it down just a little bit. And I'm going to use this draw region of interest. And I'm just going to drag this around the edges, something like that. And now I go composition, crop comp to region of interest. So now I have this composition that is the same size as my photo. And now I'm gonna go here into my corner pin and select corner pin. I'm gonna scale this down just a tad so that it matches up and now I can hit the tilde button and come here with corner pin tool selected. I'm gonna drag this and match it up here with our original shot. Make sure that you're on the first frame when you do this. So just dragging these out. I would be more detailed if I were doing this for real. I'd probably zoom in there and get it exactly right, but this is just for demonstration purposes, so this will work. And so we've got that there. Now I'm going to pre-compose the whole thing. I'm gonna move all attributes into the new composition. Now we can simply hit edit paste and our photo is going to track along beautifully. And it looks like it's actually there. And we can even, if we had a faster moving shot, we could turn on our motion blur and add that in. So you can see that we can get a planar track 
fairly fast and efficiently because we had the pattern, the planar pattern for it to track onto, and it took a matter of minutes here in Mocha.